Memes can fit into any genre. You can make the most absurd, perverted, or downright diabolical concepts into memes, and people would still laugh at it. That's the beauty of it all. Call it a shit post, if you will. Schizophrenia, a psychological or mental disorder that makes the person with this disorder see, hear, and experience things that aren't there, a form of hallucinations and delusions that will render the person to function properly, a very horrific experience. Now, what would happen if you combine the absurdity of shitpost memes and the terrifying concept of schizophrenia? Schizo memes. Schizo memes are a form of memes that makes jokes about terrifying concepts like murder, the occult, conspiracy theories, and just general pure horror. The reason why they're called schizo memes is that the punchline is the same. Schizophrenia. A meme about murder? The punchline is them going on a schizophrenic meltdown, which is why they killed someone. A meme about some conspiracy theory regarding a dead god in the bottom of the ocean? Well, that's just conspiracy theories rambled on by some schizophrenic person. The feds are gang stalking you? That's just schizophrenic delusions telling you that. Mass murder? Torture? Cannibalism? The funny voices in my head told me to do those. Basically, situations or beliefs you would have if you suffer from mental illness. Of course, they aren't being serious and just being ironic, even though the word ironic has lost all meaning. One of the best examples of schizo memes are the cursed troll physics slash rage comics. A spin on rage and troll face comics that ends in a gruesome punchline. Because of some mental breakdown or silly voices in your head, schizo spongebob memes where characters from spongebob are in terrifying situations. And fed posting. Federal agents are another punchline with these schizo memes. The federal agents are usually involved pretending to be someone, usually a woman. Or the federal agents are out to get you because you have mental illness and dangerous. Either the latter or they need you because you're dangerous, if you know what I mean. There are no known origin of where schizo memes became popular. Some say it's 4chan, which no surprise there knowing the depravity going on in that site daily. Though the punchline is usually the same, they never get stale. Well, most of the time. They're actually one of the most creative types of memes I've seen these past few years, with them being intriguing and funny at the same time. I know comedy is subjective and all, some people might find this form of humor edgy, and I don't blame them. Some schizo memes just feel a little too try hard when it comes to unnerving people that it just comes off as edgy, which is actually the aim of these memes in the first place, to unnerve people. With how diabolical or downright insane these schizo memes when it comes to its context, and or how it's depicted, it could sometimes be comedic. An obvious shock value, and with a hint of humor, these memes give you a mix of emotions that would last longer than the standard run-of-the-mill meme, which is one of their novelties. Another novelty these memes have are the sheer mystery they give off. Like, what the hell is this even supposed to reference? Is this a prophecy? Did this happen? Is it an inside joke? Now, no one likes jokes without knowing the context behind it. The only exception I usually see are schizo memes. The zero context behind on some of them makes the joke even better, in my opinion. It makes you go out of your way to research or look up what some of these memes are referencing. Don't tell me when you saw these memes you didn't google what some of them meant or what it's referring to. I know I did. And finally, the best thing about these memes are the horror aspect. A majority of these memes usually have a horrific imagery, videos, or gifs associated with them. A creepy or unsettling image combined with a funny or relatable punchline is the perfect blend of horror and comedy. If you enjoy and want to find more schizo memes, then don't worry, I know a few places. It's not like I post schizo memes ironically every week for nearly two years. Ahem. r slash distressing memes is a good place to find these memes. Or go to your favorite social media slop site and look up hashtag schizo or schizo memes you're bound to find some good ones. 
Though this isn't recommended, cause people post schizo memes unironically these days. Gone are the ironic schizo meme posting, but that's a video for another time. If you made it in the end of the video then thank you. I've been trying my hand on video essays cause meme channels on YouTube are dying off. Or resorting to YouTube shorts brain rot. And since I have a bit of decency, there's no way I'll do those which is why I'm doing long form videos now. If you did make it this far in the end of the video, then comment down below, take your meds. By the way, literally all the schizo memes you saw in this video came from Weekly Meme Dump, a weekly segment on my community tab where I post schizo memes weekly and act like some character on some ARG or analog horror. If you want to reach out to me, then here are a couple of my socials. So yeah, see ya. Also take your meds. Why is it so small? I've never seen one so small before. It's okay, honey. I love you for who you are.